What's up, Peak Timers? Today we're unboxing a brand new 2023 Hot Wheels 50 pack. If you're not familiar with these, I get these on Amazon usually a couple times a year because there's always interesting cars included inside. So it comes in this nice box and it does have short cards inside. So there's a chance for super treasure hunts or regular treasure hunts. So we're gonna open this one up and see what's inside. So we can see how all the cars are just laid in there. We're gonna take them out and have a look at each one of them. So we'll start off with our first three that we pull out right here. 2017 Audi RS6 Avant, followed by the Quick Bite in this really interesting color variation of it. Really like that one, the Hot Chicken edition of Quick Bite. Next we have the Porsche 911 Carrera RS 2.7. Check that one out. That's a great looking color on that one. Love that look in the short card. I'll grab some more that we have right here. We've got a couple of trucks. We've got the Limited Grip, which is a Hot Wheels Fantasy casting, followed by our 83 Chevy Silverado. So two cool looking trucks right there. And then right out there, I also pulled out a Track Manga, as well as a Roland Solo. So some pretty cool fantasy cars. Then we have the Lightning Bug right there. And then behind it, we've got the 2010 Camaro SS followed by a Mod Speeder. That's a new 2023 casting. Pretty neat to see. We'll grab some more out right here. We've got the Jack Hammer. And then we have the Mazda 787B. And that's a nice color variation of that Mazda put that down and then I also pulled out the Erkenstein rod in a nice white color that's a nice color variation of that one I'll we'll pull out some more right here check that out we've got the Koenigsegg Jamera in yellow absolutely love that casting very very cool in the yellow color variation and followed by the power panel right there power panel pretty neat looking casting and then behind it we've got the Alfa Romeo GTV6 3.0, and then we have the Aston Martin Vantage GTE. So those ones are two really cool looking castings. Really like the, the quality look that they've done on the wheels on this Alfa Romeo. We'll put that aside. Pulling out some more, we've got the DMC DeLorean right there. And then behind the DeLorean, we've got the Chrysler Pacifica as well as the Automobili Pininfarina Batista in white. That's, uh, I think that's our third recolor of the Pininfarina Batista. But nonetheless, cool casting, nice to see. We'll pull out a bunch more here. We've got the 87 Ford Sierra Cosworth followed by the 87 Dodge D100. So a couple of 80s cars right there. And then behind it, we had, ooh, check out the Gasser right there. We've got the 55 Chevy Bel Air Gasser. Very, very cool looking car. I put that aside and we'll grab some more in here. Ooh, one of my favorite new castings for this year. It's the Trouble Decker. Such a cool looking car. Really, really like that one. Followed it up by the Corvette C7 Z06. And then behind it, we've got a couple of cars right here. Ooh, check that out. We got the 73 Honda Civic Custom right there, followed by the Nissan Leaf Nismo RCO2 race car. Pretty neat. All right, let's see what else we have. We've got the 73 Stingray convertible. Doesn't specify it as a Corvette, but we do know it's a Corvette. There we go, we got that. And then we got, uh, we got the 2007 Ford Mustang Falcon Edition, then a now series, followed by the VW ID Buzz. Those could not be any different of vehicles right there. What do you think of those two though? Pretty neat looking. All right, we'll pull out some more right here. We've got the 69 Shelby GT500. This is a mainline. It would be a super treasure hunt, but that is the mainline variation, followed by the Lucid Air, and also another one that would be a super treasure hunt. It's the 1965 Mercury Comet Cyclone. That's a really, really cool looking casting. I like the detail on that one. So a couple of cool ones that would be super treasure hunts, but there we have the mainline variations in the short cards. So pretty happy to have those. What else do we have in here? We've got a bunch more. We're gonna just grab a bunch of them out right here and check it out. What do we have? We've got, ooh, check that one out. That's the El Segundo Coupe, which is a, a really cool looking fantasy car. I really like that one. And what else did I take out here? We've got the nice looking Pontiac Firebird from 1970 and then followed by, ooh, 
Look at that Land Cruiser. We got the Toyota Land Cruiser 80, and then we have the Lolox. I really like this Land Cruiser. I think it's a cool looking casting. I like to see all the color variations of it. So exciting to see some new ones that will be coming out in the future. Got some more cars right here. Ooh, there is our Legends Tour winning car, the Volvo P1800 Gasser right there. That's a nice looking color variation of it, followed by another one that looks kind of like a Gasser. It's the 62 Corvette Gasser. It is a Gasser, of course. There we go. And then we also have the Surf and Turf right there. And I did also pull out this one right here, which is the Drone Duty. What do you think of that one? Drone Duty, fantasy casting. And we've got the Dodge Viper RT10. This is the original casting release of it. There is a re retooled casting for 2023, which came in our, I believe it was our Q case, or it was our P or Q case that we had it in there. So we did get that one. Uh, we got the Mock It Go as well, another nice fantasy car. And then we are down to our last bit right here. Couple more here we're gonna pull out here. We've got the HW Papa Wheelie, check it out. HW Papa Wheelie, followed by the Rescue Duty. And then we have the BNW 507. And there is still some more in here. We've got four more cars here. So we got the Ford Mustang Mach-E 1400. And then we follow that by the Lotus Amira right there. Lotus Amira looks really good in that color. We're seeing lots of different color variations of that Lotus Amira. So we'll put those ones aside. We have our last two cars right here. And our last, uh, second to last car is the Coupe Clip, which is the keychain one that you can loop onto your keychain and your keys if you want to, which is pretty neat. And then our very, very last car. What do you think it's gonna be? Do you think it's gonna be a fantasy casting, a license casting? Which one do you think it's gonna be? I'm, I'm curious, I don't know. I'm surprised I never saw it at all. And our last car to reveal from this box is... Boom, right there, we have got the Dune Crusher, right there, Dune Crusher, check out the Dune Crusher, right there, nice fantasy casting, it's got that nice push bar in the front end of it, but guys, if you wanna get your own Hot Wheels 50 pack short card case of 2023s, I will link it down below, check out the current pricing, some great deals on it, I always pick these up, they're super fun to have all these castings, especially in the short cards, there's a lot of good short card collectors out there, and short cards, Hot Wheels usually tend to, tend to carry a little bit more value than the regular ones. So check those out. Thank you very much for watching this video. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.